when a black hole is created, it emits a big flash of gamma ray. And uh, we call this phenomenon uh, gamma ray burst. And uh, creation of black hole is extremely important scientific uh, subject, and we don't know much about it. So all the information we can gather is important. So with Polar, we want to answer one question is that, are those gamma rays that are produced polarized? And uh, this polarization will tell us a lot about magnetic field and things like that during the formation of black hole. So this is exactly the question we want to answer with Polar 2 in Chinese space station. You know, those detectors are kind of uh, unique and uh, state of the art. So uh, yes, it is complicated to, to construct them. But I think we, for the Polar 2, we finished now completely the prototyping state. We, we know exactly what we want to, to build. The result we, we get in the lab with the prototype are, are really excellent. So we, we start to cut metal now, and uh, we hope to be ready in 2026. So launch date around 2026. Collaboration with the scientists was really excellent. Uh, we we shared the, the same uh, will and the same uh, way of, of working. And uh, I think China is, is very open and uh, the opportunity are, are really very, very interesting. Uh, I know that you have very uh, exciting science projects like uh, space telescope, extremely good space telescope. You know, this opened a very, very nice uh, a project for, for science in China. And I'm very happy that China is opening that to international collaboration. And I really hope that as many people as possible will, will use this opportunity.